it's yet another very beautiful day right here it's a very beautiful evening and this is econ tv or lakanar kangini paran ido today we have yet another beautiful session and we have a number of guests in uh, the building here we will be sharing a lots of good things and uh, uh, with me i have different guests and that we shall be sharing a lots of different different things here uh, and make sure you uh, follow and of course want to welcome everybody remember to tell a friend and let a friend also inform a friend make sure you get a pen and a paper sit down get to write some of these things if they have not yet happened to you they are about to happen to you and of course uh, wow if you get to learn a lot of more things here they might help you solve a family problem now with me i have a beautiful lady and i would want to make her introduce herself to us and then we get to know her better madam good evening good evening how are you i'm called laura katshabe that's my name that is her name laura katshabe and i have a gentleman with me right here a very handsome young man come on hi hello hello hi fine what's so good my name is Mr. Deke. Mr. Deke. Yeah, Mr. Deke, thank you very much for hosting us. All right, you're most welcome. And this is uh, Econ TV, Ola Kanar Kangini Paran. In case of any inquiry, our number is just right there at the screen. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you get updated and you get notified whenever we bring in new, new kind of videos now today we shall be discussing a lot of good things and uh, in our discussion these are things that always happen to us all time every time anywhere in whatsoever that we keep on doing now uh all of us we come from homes uh, all of us have friends all of us have those people our friends eh? we love them there are those even we don't love and we can't avoid them and always when they come to us we feel like in fact there are those even we just welcome them in our homes and uh, you're not comfortable being with them you know just because the bible says love your neighbors you don't have yourself but because in actual sense eh? <laughs> yeah that's why i'm telling you about this uh, there are friends that we feel comfortable you know uh, as a company company friends but uh because sometimes you're lacking to be with other friends, you just have to call them Babira or like Babire Bere Yo. So that's a Babire Wo, Kuba Munange, Tetuna Wakubateka. In terms of so, Oja Sike Sida Nepene, a mame ni Chakariso case. Iburokuata Mun. Mere. <laughs> so right here on Econ TV, Rai Alakanar, Ido Jai Kopane Koto, Agea Alakanar, Nepekane. And uh, we are here. Uh, what we are saying here is maybe you are here, you are that woman. Take an example. You have your home. You have your ghetto in case you don't have a home. Yes, your very home, your very own home. You have you're sleeping in your father's house or your mother's house. And uh, you have a room at least that you call your room. Or maybe you share with your big brother, your young kid, at least a brother who almost who is almost your age, no? And you have a friend visiting you. Uh, you have a friend visiting you, a friend wants to spend some good days uh maybe at your place and then these people can come with weird kind of uh uh manners i don't know if it has ever happened to you like a friend bumpers into maybe your room i don't know if you i don't know if you have your home or you have your room and then he's there he is having some kind of weird kind of uh a manner and you don't uh, you don't appreciate the manner I <laughs> anyway, uh, I might say, uh, are you trying to mean like uh, what what are our friends do in our rooms or in our homes no. or in our places that we would not like? But there's no way you can tell that person. In the context of That's friends, in the context of friends, whom we as we, we began from the beginning, some even you you just want them because the Bible says love your friend as you love your neighbor now this is a friend who has bumpered into you you don't love him he's there he's having weird manners what are some of those weird manners that upsets you okay. yes you can't tolerate okay one um okay with with experience or what you think uh i want to believe i want to believe it has ever happened to you i am just thinking just imagine 
or it is about to happen to you or you've had a friend complaining uh -huh. now now you're asking me the right thing uh -huh. maybe it has not happened to me but what are those weird things they do that i i see i look at them as weird one uh like a friend coming to my place mm -hmm. and you you're putting on my clothes you know yeah Maybe there's that favorite dress of mine you already see me put on now because you have come to my home, you want to put on my dress. Mm. Or you're putting on my t-shirt, you know. And everyone around knows it is my t-shirt and you're putting it on. When you move, they'll start saying, ah, oh, those people share clothes. Those, th 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 that clique of girls, mm. they share clothes. Yet it's my cloth. <laughs> and for you, I've liked it. You also feel like to put on. <laughs> I, that's what I don't like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, somebody shares a t-shirt and somebody wants to move around, let all the neighbors. Yes. If your home is next to a border border stage, they want the border borders to also feel you on that uh, kind of a t-shirt. Uh, to me, I feel uh, such friends, the, yes, we have them very many. Yeah. But to what irritates me a lot is mm. this kind of friends, you know, we move with them. We talk, we joke, we drink, we do whatever we do, we get it, eh? Then at the end of the day, they go back, begin talking about you again, you get it? Again tomorrow, very early in the morning, the very first people knocking your door. Ah, how are you, Mr. DK? How are you doing, man? Eh? You get it? I think that's but Anyway, uh, such friends happen, they, but I feel to me, I, there's no way you can avoid them, you get it? Because first of all, don't have clear evidence like... They did it, <laughs> but the friends are the ones who are moving with uh, such friends are the ones end up telling you, No money, okay. You trust that man, he even even is he's even dressing up your clothes, putting up and your talks clothes, about talks you. about you, but you have no clear information about them. But, uh, Mr. Decker, should I ask you something? Yeah. Do you fear people talking about you or your friends talking about you? No, Do you have that? Me, I don't want someone to talk about me. That's the first thing about me, by the way. I don't like it completely. Better you come and tell me, Hello, Mr. Decker, I don't like what you do. Yeah. Whatever. Mm. You take it, like, I get to understand exactly this is what my friends don't like about me. You get it, eh? Mm. Sometimes people have taken us for granted, like, they take us, like, you, you tell a person, I don't like this. Mm. The person takes, looks at you bad. Let me tell you one thing you should learn, eh? Mm. If, if, if they're not talking about you, then you know, you're nowhere or you're no one. You get? Mm. So from today, to, uh, tomorrow, if you hear Laura or Marcelo or anyone talked about you, just say, yeah, at least Talk about at me least that I'm you're someone. bringing me money. Don't talk about <laughs> me these other things. <laughs> ah, okay. On Econ TV, it was already one of you. did that. It was Do you fear being talked about? Otherwise, talking about me makes me even fat. Thank you. Talk about me. Talk about me. Mr. Deke got 20 million shillings. You get it? Why do you want to be talked about if you have gotten just that 20 million? Because I'm very happy when you're talking about me. About anything. I'm very okay. Because at least I, I, I take also your time, you know? You also get that time that you should get time to talk about Laura. Oh my God! Hey, <laughs> remember this is a Con TV. Uh, when you get to like this video, please don't forget to like it, subscribe, and remember to drop for us that comment. It matters a lot, and it will help us do a lots of good things. Now here, Marcelo, yes. well, you didn't tell us what nags you about the friend. This is a friend, uh -huh. and I am very disturbed with friends of Arsenal, supporters of Arsenal. <laughs> no, I am not starting. Because when you see my new, now you're bringing Arsenal. No, no, I am telling you, a friend who nagged me. Uh, uh, this is a, an Arsenal. Fan. Okay. This is a guy who comes when remember when they banged the my news Liverpool banged the my news seven. This is a guy who came early as early as six, knocking on my door. To, 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 to. Yeah. Marcelo, do you know what is in town? Hey, le, le, le. No, this is a guy. I was like, I thought maybe there was some kind of happening, oh. some something, just uh, maybe a street kind of oh. something it's bigger. Hey. In town here. Oh, only to tell me, Aseno, why ye are Gundi, Liverpool, why are the man you seven? And I was like, hey, come on, sir, come <laughs> on. by the way. I take a TV, a TV. This is not right, okay? Uh, if you know you have nothing to do, you get it. 
Let's stick around to your room. Because they are talking about money. Yeah, I'm done moving around talking about uh, some of our money fans. <laughs> now we are hurt. You get it? <laughs> now, adding us <laughs> more stress. The other thing that nags me is a friend. You know me, I put on clothes uh, of uh, downtown. Mm. You know? And uh, oh. uh, Chikubo. 2000 maybe the most expensive clothes you can i can maybe pluck on is maybe of 10k are you sure listen to are me. you sure i am telling you what i'm telling you relax this shoe this is this is uh uh this is uh, i remember kamutua <laughs> lokani 10k <laughs> <laughs> you see, uh, you you very well know I am this guy who gets a uh, t-shirt and then for you you are this guy, the boutique guy, first class. You come to my room, you get maybe even me have some covers, but because I don't put on it one time and again, it is there. And then when you come to my room, you get it, it shocks you, eh? and you start feeling some jello jello, and then you start telling me, Marcelo, there's some five thousand here. You give me that shirt. Kumbe also bought it. Nganange nevu demu. Echo chimala mua man even if you're my friend. I don't I want friends who think every good thing belongs to only them. It nags me a lot. Well, such friends vanange. Stop being jealous of your friends. You people who are jealous of Marcelo. Hey. <laughs> Stop. There are those ones who are jealous of you also. <laughs> me, I don't care. Actually, if you're getting your time to be jealous of me, or taking your time to hate me, or to like me, or to love me, I appreciate every time you waste on me. I swear I don't take it for granted. I'm very happy. <laughs> By the way, uh, someone talking about talking about someone's it's right, but you know it's an offense. If we talk about the person, like, yeah. like you know that you have no clear information about the person, you go out and begin talking to the person. That is tarnishing someone's name, image around, you get it. Uh, I don't know how they call it. Nadala Katimweba celeb, some of you are celebrities yeah. in town. Yeah, like, you talk about me, my name is Eric Gessard Brown, you get it, Mr. Deke. Mr. Deke. Brown out and, and there. And you have worked for it. Yes, and I've you worked work for, for your name. Yeah, hey. and you go out there and begin talking about Mr. Deke, Mr. Deke, Mr. Deke. Definitely, I'll come with you with the law. I have no time. You talk about the Kuman property. The Kuman property. But, but for sure, guys, eh? stop talking about Marcelo. Stop talking about Odeke. But for Laura, please, talk about me. Talk about me. That's what I... Should I talk about you? No problem. Should I talk about you? You're looking... um. <laughs> ah, I didn't say that. <laughs> On Econ TV, lots of fun and lots of everything. Of course, remember to uh, advertise with us now that the festivity is coming. Our number will just be moving on your screen right there. And of course, remember to tell a friend so that we share in a lots of good things. And this evening, wow, it's just fun and a lots of sharing right here. Laura says. As you as you were still talking about uh, what nags us uh, when someone visits you and does something that you don't like, um, when someone visits you and uses your toothbrush to br uh, is it called to brush your teeth or to polish your teeth? <laughs> <laughs> now me would not go to a nursery school. <laughs> Which English should okay. I? Okay, whichever it is. To brush your teeth and use my toothbrush in my nugs. Now, what if you get a guy, a guy trying to pluck on your box? Eh? You are the wash, and eh, because this is a friend from a villa and he has come to town, he's seeing a boxer. Let me, to me, what I feel your is. Your friend this. is a boy, then plucks on your boxer. Yeah. Oh my Listen, god. To me, I feel it is. It's not really normal, you know, to share toothbrush. You get it? It's not normal. It's not even right. Not even. How do you begin doing it, man? Uh, uh, you see, he realized that uh, bacteria, you know, to bacteria, <laughs> it happens to be some people, you know, mm. uh, maybe end up coping. <laughs> <laughs> uh, in our test, so we say people have a lot of anyamis, and in that anyamis, they have a lot of things. Eh? It's like you guys don't have what nags you to, uh, like visitors That's who nag, yeah. eh? you don't have that experience of visitors nagging you. There is also a vista coming to your home and wants to oversleep you know yesterday you you cooked supper you ate on you used plates to eat 
the house needs to be mopped, clothes have to be washed. What, what, but once just to sleep, you wash clothes, you cook food, you know, and is they are nagging you, even asking, is the food ready? You just wake up, eh? he just wakes up around and maybe showers, eats your food, goes back to bed. Oh, now with this smartphone, water. Yeah. there are these that those friends that Laura's just spoken right now is this, eh? yes. there are very many out there. Hey. What they do only is one, it's morning. Laura, you're the owner of the home. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. your work is to cook for them. Mm -hmm. Their work wash is to plates. Their work is to watch. Relax. Be on TikTok, mm -hmm. on Facebook, Thank on you. WhatsApp. Hey. Now, and with this smartphone, eh? They will tell you, let's first go for a walk. After coming back from a walk, would have refreshed your head, your brain now down. Mm -hmm. Now you're happy. Again, reaching home like this, they go direct to bed. And for you, and you even have fetching to cook water, they fetch water. <laughs> <laughs> they are there with these smartphones. Eh? When they are sleeping, they are busy watching uh, videos of TikTok. You hear them laughing. You guys don't have what nag you. Let me tell you another thing. Eh? Another thing is a friend coming to your house and wants to talk on phone up to late in the night you want to sleep off or is, is watching TV and it is on high volume mm. you want to sleep someone is on phone yes baby <laughs> Whoa, singing for the boyfriend will, will that not be jello jello on your side it's not jello jello I have to have my piece and I sleep off but you're making noise for me in the room let me tell the truth yes. uh, there's a time when I was uh, I had a friend I had a friend uh, she, she's within sorority but uh, she's a student of one university in Kampala there. So she, she was done with her, uh, her final papers, but she got a retake somewhere. I'm not going to mention her name. So this is a girl left Soroti to go back to Kampala. Not even to the retake, just to be there disturbing a friend. But all the time she could call me on video call, like uh, she's just enjoying someone's making noise in someone's room, playing a woof, a volume like 100%. Thank you. That's what I mean. Time. What do you even leave your home and just you you find a girl a girl down from maybe let's say which one is the deepest which district do you come from mine, hey mine is the deepest by the way mine is the deepest. I want to talk about Teso oh hey. okay. by the way I come from Bukedia Bukedia is within near Habai okay I know now let me not use anyone's district here but what I'm trying to mean you find somebody from down Dani and Daniake which one is your district? Soroti. Of course, we are the big bulls, the command property around town, you know. <laughs> so, uh, somebody comes deep from the village, certain things he has not seen for the first time. And then when she gets or he gets to see that, they become so excited, you know. Already they see in their heads that, uh, like now, our friends, you see, you realize what uh, some people told me sometimes, that when our people move from Soroti here, somebody could have started in deep the school that i started in came did everything now it is because of just going to campus that somebody had a chance to cross to kampala and even in kampala the person is around chile kabo you get it a banda those suburbs eh? uh, and eh? somebody's going to come i am in the city now you find those of marcelo who have been down in chikubo with no food they're like dogs of the city they know every corner and now you're coming you're in the village you're showing them that you see what because you're back and they want to call them eh? they want to call themselves abateso for us here we say we are iteso for them it will me am from where amuria just the word of baganda <laughs>